Stephen had the new grand opening of the CCSE Superstore. What an incredible turnout tonight. Incredible. You know, I think that uh, it's been a number of months since the football club's had a, a store to, to obviously sell the merchandise from. And, uh, you know, I think that a lot of people have worked extremely hard in the background to create this. And it's, it's a wonderful store. And I think it's, it's very much in keeping with what I would describe as a big football club. Of course, this, probably, this turnout probably shows that the club is still at the heartbeat of this city. Yeah, you know, and one of the reasons I came to this football club was that uh, it was very much a club of enormous potential and I think tonight is very much proof of that. What have the fans been saying to you? Of course you've been absolutely crowded tonight and we saw some fans chanting your name and you cut the ribbon. What have some fans been saying to you? You better not lose any more games <laughs> or you'll be out. <laughs> no, I, I, it's, it's obviously, uh, you know, a good feeling amongst the supporters just now when you're on the back of a six game unbeaten run and uh, you've won your last four then there's a lot of positivity about the place but uh, as I've said to you many times uh, if I lose a couple of games that chant will change. <laughs> and it's a long season of course as well so this positivity we have at the moment amongst the fans which seems tonight it needs to stick there doesn't it? It is and if I could bottle it I would <laughs> that's the truth you know it's uh, it's a good feeling the supporters have just now I think that they're, they're very proud of the way the players are going about their business and uh, you know, there's an energy about the club and I think that that's very important. I think it's been reflected in the way people have spoken tonight. Jordan, we're at the new CCFC store, grand opening. This is an incredible turnout, isn't it? It is an incredible turnout. I mean, there's hundreds of people that have turned up today and it's good to see that we've got so much support for the club. How many uh, signatures do you think you've made tonight? Around the 100 mark, I'd say, at the minute. But, uh, still got an hour left, so could uh, hit the 200 mark. I suppose this just shows, obviously, we all know the situation, but we're not playing in Coventry at the moment, but you know, this still, it shows that the club is still the heartbeat of the city. Yeah, I mean, we understand why um, fans don't turn up or can't make it to the um, Northampton games, but I mean, it's good to see all the support we have got from the um, club um, store opening. Jordan, at the uh, new CCSE Superstore grand opening, it's an incredible night, I suppose, isn't it? Yeah, definitely. There's a lot of, it's, a, it's a great turnout. There's a lot of fans that came down, and um, the store's looking great. And... Uh, I'm a bit annoyed that Callum's face is up on the wall, but I can't do anything about that. But um, yeah, it's, 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 it's a really good location, and, and as you can see, it looks really good. So, but like you say, Callum's face on the wall. Surely we didn't obviously think that through because now people should be turning away from the shop. Exactly, that's what I mean. Like you could have picked like a better looking person, but you, you decided yourself. To, you decided to pick the ugly, the ugly, one of the ugliest teammates, but it's fine. I can get over it. But um, <laughs> but yeah, um, as I say, it would have been nice to have um, have myself on the wall. But what can you do? Eh? Why don't you print off your own picture and just stick it there or something? Oh, an A4, just put it there. Yeah. It's fantastic. It shows like the amount of support, obviously, um, you know, the fans have for Coventry, and it shows, you know, togetherness from the staff, you know, the whole team to the fans, how together, you know, we are. Of course, you know, what do you think of the new club shop? It's good. It's big. It's, it's big. It's bigger than a fort. So, you know, it's a, you know, it's good size and, you know, good. Yeah, very good. And. Considering how big it is, we've been able to fill it tonight. Now, how many people have asked you about your goal at Wolves tonight? I can't, I can't remember, but it's, you know, it's, it's just great to see so many fans turn up and show their support to the players, and you know, it's really good. Of course, now people know your name as well. I suppose that's just testament to, to how well you're doing this season. I, I, you know, what an impact you have in the first team when you when you're in it. No, it's just fantastic to be playing for Coventry. So, you know, just play as many games as I can and show what I can do. Did you get uh, beaten on FIFA earlier, by the way? Um, let's not talk about that. Uh, I did get beaten. Uh, however... You got an excuse? However, I played uh, another game with uh, a Sky Sports man and uh, I was beating him 2-0 and the game got cut short, so, you know. So it's a half-and-half -half situation. Who is, who is actually the best out of you, Cov lads? Who do you feel? Well, out of the lads here, I'm not going to say I am because I, I play Call of Duty, but um, I'll probably... Mm, Callum, Callum, Callum talks to talk. However, I was I was popping him a minute ago, but um, Cyrus is decent. He's consistent. 
All three of them are decent. I, yeah. I, I can't I can't pick one because I don't want to make the heads big. So. But is this you know the 132 inch screen? Is probably, is, is that going to make you turn up more now? Or are you just going to every day off you have just to be standing there hogging the controls? That's what I mean, um, if, if it's going to be here every day, then uh, <laughs> you might find me down here a lot. So and of course on sale tonight is an extra 1,000 tickets for the MK Duns game at the end of the month, which we're expected to get to around 6,000 there, which is incredible. Which is remarkable, and again I think it you know very much highlights the the enormity of this football club and the potential of this football club and uh, you know we're all very excited by it and you know we're at the start of a, a new era I think you know we're at the start of a, a hopeful uh, period where we can see the club progress and it'll be great to have all the supporters on board. Of course you know we've seen tonight a lot of young supporters as well which is like you say it's a new era and that's of course it needs new supporters I suppose. Yeah and you can't forget that that uh, you know, at all times you have to work very hard on continually improving your support and uh, you know, hopefully the style of football that has been played, hopefully that we are playing a lot of young lads from Coventry that people can identify themselves with will have a will have a bearing on, on uh, you know, attracting new supports to the football club.